It's not as if these two are unfamiliar with each other. Aston Villa and Everton are founding members of the Football League. They first met in 1888. Villa won that one 2-1 by the way. What a match it was, if memory serves me right. The thing is, they're just so similar. Really old, really beloved, proper football clubs. The stadiums are roughly the same size and don't have corporate names. At least just not yet. And overall, after all these years, have both beaten each other 82 times with 60 draws thrown in. Now this season, Everton have started really well, sitting in a Champions League spot. And yeah, I know it's early, but still that is really impressive for Rafa Benitez and company. While Villa have actually played better than their top place standing. Still, this just feels like a draw to me. After all, last season's fixture was nil-nil, but I like goals in this one with Aston Villa's Danny Ings looking really solid with two and three so far, and Everton's Andros Townsend looking back to his vintage best. What a goal that was against Burnley on Monday. Now, it should be mentioned that Villa's goalkeeper Emi Martinez and record signing Emiliano Buendia were missing in the loss to Chelsea last weekend as they went against the Premier League's wishes and travelled to Argentina for World Cup qualifying. And you know how that turned out, right? Which means quarantine. Now, they are available for this one, but will they have their wrists slapped? Sorry, there are no odds for wrist slapping as far as I can tell at the moment. Still, Villa Everton just sounds like a football match, doesn't it? Like a nice, comfy pair of slippers.